Our images of the restless and gentle spirit of God expand our understanding of the spirit's presence in the world and the nature of healing. Jesus, in his first sermon, said, the spirit of the Lord is upon me. And quoting Isaiah, to preach good news, liberty to the oppressed, sight to the blind, freedom to the captives, and the year of God's favor, the year of jubilee, the year of shalom, the year in which persons, the nations, and the planet is healed. There is a moral and spiritual arc that runs through all things, that's at work in human history, that is work in the universe. And this is surely the work of the spirit. God's spirit is as near as our next breath. The spirit speaks to us in sighs too deep for words. But the spirit is also blowing through all creation. The groanings of the spirit are also present in our own yearnings for wholeness. The Holy Spirit moves toward wholeness, the wholeness of our emotional life, the wholeness and healing of relationships. It moves through ourselves as well as our souls, seeking abundant life for each one of us. But more than that, it moves through our communities, our congregations, the nation and the planet. The Spirit ranges far beyond Christianity to embrace the whole earth. The spirit heals and the spirit reminds us to be healing partners, to listen to the spirit, to follow the spirit where she leads us and then to embody the spirit in acts of love, of welcome, of hospitality, of healing, of body, mind, spirit and communities. That is the restless, the gentle spirit that embodies the way of Jesus and the love of God.